Hi, I'm Radley Moss, Senior Director of Communications at Semaphore. I'm here today to talk about Semaphore's partnership with North Shore University Health System. Uh, delighted to be joined by Eric Schultz, founder and CEO of Semaphore, and Kristen Mercer, Chief Administrative and Strategy Officer at North Shore. Uh, so we're going to kick things off by talking about why North Shore and Semaphore decided to establish a partnership. And Kristen, maybe you can start off by talking about that. Here at North Shore, everything we do is really rooted in being able to deliver value for our patients and communities. We have a long-standing commitment in history in advancing genomic care. But in Semaphore, we found a partner that was really aligned in that vision of both being able to drive value and impact for our patients today, but also with incredible opportunity and curiosity for what might be possible in the future. So the ability to drive value today, but also the aspiration and curiosity for what might be possible as we look to what's next is really what drew us to partnership with Semaphore. That's great. And Eric, what's your perspective? It was exciting to find a system like North Shore that was very committed, very progressive in engaging more state-of-the-art information like genomics to make more informed decisions, to better characterizations of the patient population. And so we saw a partnership with North Shore as a way to help unlock the power of genomics that Semaphore is dedicated to unlocking in terms of improving our ability to diagnose and uh, treat disease and uh, maintain wellness. And Kristen, how do you expect Semaphore to you know, benefit your patients and sort of the communities that you serve? Some of the exciting things about this partnership, first founded again in driving value for our patients, is how can we integrate genomic data and use that to create a more complete picture of our patients, their care, and then utilize that to inform and empower our patients to make better decisions, both in terms of how they take care of themselves, but also to, to inform and enable our practitioners and how they partner with our patients to make informed care decisions. Clearly that is uh, right at the center of what Semaphore does, not only in their testing platform, but advanced analytics to drive insights. So that is, is the core reason and the core opportunity for our patients. Uh, but another aspect that excited us as well, and something new with this partnership, is a commitment to extend that capability and make sure it is available um, to our more diverse members of our community. So a decided part of our partnership, enabled by local philanthropy, is a commitment to make sure we are offering an intentionally um, including more diverse populations in our offerings. So this partnership has spurned and has given us the opportunity to translate a lot of our materials into a variety of different languages and to really figure out how we make this incredible insight into care accessible to all members of our community. Eric, just building upon one of the elements that Kristen mentioned, you know, how do you expect Semaphore's data-driven approach to improving health outcomes to uh, benefit uh, North Shore? You know, again, it's about standardizing the genomic platform on which, you know, patients can be, be profiled and tested. And so it's providing, no matter what the initial insight is, whether it's in the reproductive health arena, heritable cancer, genomic health screening, we can generate a standardized exome and low-pass whole genome worth of data to inform throughout then the life course of the patient. As the, you know, the rate of information, the rate of knowledge growth is exponential in the genomics arena. Having a partner like North Shore that's committed to adapting at the rate of learning and bringing those sorts of advances into, into the standard of care and advising uh, patients throughout their life course. Kristen mentioned on the democratizing access to that kind of technology. Genetics has impacts that differ between population groups. Uh, the kinds of insights we can provide take that kind of ancestry into account where we can leverage the genomic information to understand very precisely how a particular variant, say in a, in a cancer gene, may pre predispose uh, one population group to uh, uh, heritable cancer, but protect another. Like you need to have uh, that level of understanding and, and one of uh, our core areas of expertise is in taking that uh, ancestry into account and being able to 
you know, offer that into the North Shore uh, system, especially in the underserved communities. Kristen, how do you expect the partnership to evolve over time? The future is some of what excites me most in terms of how do we not just build on the base we have today, but as Eric said, the rate of change, the acceleration of knowledge means more and new insights are available to us every day. So as we work together in partnership, how are we able to unlock some of those future looking benefits that allow us to better drive actionable insights for our patients? And that's something we're very much looking forward um, to crafting that future together. And Eric, your thoughts on the, the future of the partnership? Again, the, you know, the big attraction is, is uh, having, you know, Semaphore and North Shore in this learning based uh, partnership where we're learning together as, you know, again, the rate of information growth continues to accelerate how to make that type of information more accessible to, for example, primary care physicians in addition to specialists. How to, how to engage patients with that kind of information. That type of information has implications into family members as well. So how to make that uh, more holistic. So I see as we uh, kind of progress in this relationship, it's going to be uncovering, learning a lot of uh, the best practices and best ways to engage in addition to the information uh, growth and bringing that in, you know, to bear into the decision making. It's going to be, you know, providing a way more holistic engagement uh, within the system and around the patient, and using, you know, more complex data, more comprehensive data to to provide the best outcomes. So it's sort of a uh, increasing resolution over time to, uh, you know, an understanding what's happening in in that patient population. That sounds great. Clearly, we have some exciting times ahead of us, and just want to, you know, thank thank you both for. Uh, you know, joining this uh, this video for anyone who is interested in learning more information about Semaphore's partnership with North Shore, you can visit uh, our website and view the press release on the news section. So thank you again for your time today. Thank you. Thank you, Radley.